Hi, I'm David Schoenholm. If the recommendation is that you keep all your notes of what you have to do in one single place, does that mean that you shouldn't have a calendar and a to-do list? That would be two places, wouldn't it? No. Of course, you should have a calendar as well as a to-do list. It will not get messy because you write different things between the two tools. As I see it, if something needs to get done on a specific time, such as at 10 a.m. or at 2 p.m., it belongs in your calendar. A meeting is time-specific, of course, because it starts at 10 a.m. sharp. A promised phone call at 2 p.m. is also time-specific, so that's added to the calendar as well. Keep all other tasks on your to-do list. If you need to do something sometime during a specific day, but it doesn't matter when during the day, set a due date for the task and let it stay on the to-do list. But why? Well, if you mix meetings, time-specific tasks and non-time-specific things in your calendar, it will become crowded and messy. It will be unnecessarily hard for you to distinguish when you are available and not, and you will have to spend unnecessary time moving non-time-specific things forward in your calendar if you happen to not do them exactly when they randomly occur in the calendar. So, time-specific things in the calendar, everything else on your to-do list. Do you agree?